All right, all right, all right. Hey, YouTube, I'm Lucky, and we're back yet again farming for God Rolls. This time I got 600 Iron Banner tokens. We're at Lord Saladin. I also have a ton of Engrams in the Postmaster that I might turn in as well if I don't get anything worth keeping. So let's go ahead and turn these in and see what we get. Ooh, a multi mock right off the rip. We got Subsistence one for all. Wow, that sounds like an insanely good roll for PvE. I'm going to 1,000% be keeping that. Can you imagine clearing ads with that? That'd be really good. Uh, the armor, I'm not going to take a minute to look at the armor because honestly, I'm not really, I don't really care too much for the armor. I'm sure it's like 60 plus stuff, which is good. The finite impact are dropping. Wow. Little killing wind, multi-kill clip. Not bad. Not bad at all. I'll take it. So far, so good. We're having a good start. The time-worn spire. Subsistence one for all also. Wow. Okay. Okay. I'm liking all these rolls. Hey, not everything can be a god roll, but those are not bad. Those are not bad. Some armor. More armor. Oh my gosh, all the armor in the world, man. What the heck? Oh, the Rizwalker. This is the one I'm looking for. Quick draw, iron reach. This is the number one weapon I want. Let's see what we get. I have the Storm Demolitionist. Eh! That is not it. Nope. I really want that quick draw iron reach roll. I also want the sidearm with swashbuckler. That would also be extra dope. We got the pulse rifle this time. We got surplus and iron grip massively improves weapon stability at the cost of reload speed. I'll take it. I'll give up the reload speed. We even got flared magwell and reload speed masterworks. So it's definitely going to be a nice trade off. This thing is probably going to be a real laser gun. So I will actually be using that. See what else we get from this. Time Worn Spire. Moving target and iron gaze. Wow. Moves target acquisition at the cost of range. That is not it for mouse and keyboard, that's for sure. For controller, that sounds like a, a really good perk though. Another time worn spire. This time we got under pressure rampage. Nice. I'll take it. I'll take it. That sounds a lot better. And next up, we'll see what we get this time. We got this goofy barnacle cloak. Another multi mock. This time we got hip fire grip one for all. Definitely not going to be as nasty as subsistence one for all. That's for sure. We can agree on that at least. And we got the guiding sight scout rifle. Wow, I haven't seen this thing in forever. This thing is a 150 RPM. Ugh. Oh no. This thing is not it. Imagine how bad this reload speed is going to be. Extended mag plus iron grip. The reload speed is going to be non existent. That's going to be the worst reload speed of any gun in Destiny. Another Rizwalker. Firmly planted demolitionist. Rip. Big rip. Not what I'm looking for at all. A peace bond. Finally, we got one. Swashbuckler. Oh my god. Yes. Yes. This is going to be actually really good. I'm actually excited for this. Very, very happy about it. All right, I have to make some space here. So if I had to choose one. I will definitely delete this multi mock because this one is way, way better. Um, I also will probably delete. This moving target, Iron Gaze, Time Worn Spire, that can go. But I am going to keep this Guiding Sight that's atrocious because I just want to see how hilariously slow this thing reloads. Got some armor, some armor, and another Forge's Pledge. Here we go. Zen Moment and Iron Grip. Okay, so you cause some damage and you get crazy stability. And then you get even more stability at the cost of reload speed. This is a lot of stability here. A lot of stability. A real laser gun. Here we go. Next up. Another time worn spire. What's it this time? Moving target iron gaze. I think this is the exact rule I just deleted. I think I just deleted this one. So the game was like, here, don't you want another one? No, I do not. So we get this time. The Archon's Thunder Machine Gun. Ooh. 
in this one a bit. I think this is like one of those slow fire ones, if I remember correctly. Not too interesting of a rule either on that one. Got some gauntlets. A barnacle cloak. Another barnacle cloak. Great. And an Archon's Thunder. What role do we got on this one? Surplus Elemental Capacitor. Wow, okay. With Surplus and Elemental Capacitor, you could probably get some crazy handling if you're using an Arc subclass. I don't know if that really matters much with the machine gun, but uh, I'll hang on to it for now. Another multi mock. This time we've got Killing Wind and Iron Gaze. It does give you more target acquisition at the cost of weapon range on an SMG. It sounds terrible, though. I will be deleting that immediately. On a weapon that needs about as much range as it can get. That's not it. And another peace bond. What do we get this time? This is a god roll here. Look at this. What? Max range swashbuckler peace bond? Are you kidding me? Are you kidding me? That's insane. That's insane. That was my last one. That's insane. Max range. That is a perfect roll. I was like, it was a god roll from the two first two perks. I was already stoked. And then I looked at the rest. It was literally like a perfect god roll. That's insane. All right. So we got all these iron engrams to turn in. Rizwalker, quick draw demolitionist. No. Oh, I just need quick draw iron reach. Why? I'm gonna delete this one. I'm gonna delete these other trash ones then. I have the storm. I've been I've been gassing up. I have the storm. A new video is coming out about that. Or if it hasn't already released at this point, that's the time you're watching this on YouTube. Here we go. We got a few more iron engrams turning. in. The occluded finality of the telescope sniper. It's 1330, so I gotta hang on to that bad boy for sure. He spawned. What is it gonna be this time? Healing Wind Harmony. That's not bad, but it's certainly no Rangefinder Swashbuckler. God roll. That's for damn sure. Check, check, check. A Barnacle Cloak? Check. The Steady Hand. Yes, I've actually been looking for this. This is not the role I've been looking for, though. This is not the role. Not too bad, though. I will delete. I will delete this one and let's get on to the next one check, check, this is a 1330 so i gotta make sure i hang on to this the trash roll but i will be definitely infusing that one Transfer. another barnacle cloak and an occluded finality telescope sniper once again with mulligan and iron reach well that is interesting all right so we can delete all this other stuff in terms of armor i'll give you an idea of what i got 64 stat 62 stat um, 61, 61, 64, 60, 62, 58, 62, 60. And then obviously the cloaks are just cloaks. In terms of weapons, I got a bunch of actually really good stuff here. Subsistence one for all. This is a PVE rolled multi mock. That's for sure. Subsistence one for all time. War spiral will also, I mean, will kind of work for PVE. I mean, a pulse rifle is going to be harder to proc one for all because all three of the bullets are going to hit like one target. So it's going to take a little longer to proc that. But, uh, still 540, so it's a fast fire. And I will give it a try. We'll, hit, we'll let it collect some dust in the vault, at the least. Uh, a rampage roll of the this, more of a PvE roll, a PvP roll, rather. And then this guiding sight. Oh my gosh, this thing is just so bad. I'm just going to load myself into the EDZ real quick. While I inspect the rest of these. Because these are just... I just want to see how bad this reload is on this thing. And then we got the peace bonds. This one is just so, so good. Full bore, maximum range perk, max range perk, max range perk, range finder, like perfect range and swatch. This is a, this is a true god roll. No matter who you are, where you're from, what you think a god roll for the piece one is, that is it. Uh, a pretty average roll of the steady hand. And a decent roll of the Rizwalker with quick draw. Demolitionist. I guess it's not bad if I'm using a, you know, shatter dive, right? And some other pretty average weapons in here. Nothing too crazy. And the machine guns as well. All just sort of average, decent rolls for those. All right, let's see what the reload is on this bad boy. Oh! Oh my god. 
Guardian's got arthritis, but that's a wrap for this video. Make sure to subscribe if you enjoyed. Smash the like button. I'll see you in the next one. Thanks for watching. Later.